Hi, this video is especially for the students at St. Agatha for your guitar class. And this is your first flat picking song. This is called Bile and Cabbage Down. And I'm just going to remind you of a few things before we get started. The first being that when you're doing flat picking, you want to make sure that you anchor either a finger here on your pick guard or you can also anchor here on your bridge pins with your wrist and that's going to allow you to be able to go back and forth a lot easier than if your arm is just up in the air floating okay and then the next thing that we're going to do um, we're going to be playing it on just two strings on your second string and your third string which is the B string and the G string and if you play this with a group you're going to want to use your capo with the second fret which would make it in the key of A but today what I'm going to do is just show you without the capo so that you can practice it and I'm going to play it through once so you can listen to it one two three four <laughs> is the down, up, down, up with the guitar pick. Make sure that you're holding your pick between your thumb and your first finger and make sure that most of your pick is in your fingers and not sticking out. You don't want a lot of pick sticking out like this. You want to make sure that most of it's in your hand like this and that you're going to be um, facing that pick then in towards your strings and what we're going to be doing is on the B string, the second string, we're going to be going down, up, down, up. So it's down, up, down, up. And then you're going to go to the first fret of your guitar, second string. And you're going to go down twice. Down, down. That's your first phrase, so it ends up sounding like this. Down, up, down, up, first finger, down. And there's a little bit of a pause when you after you play the first finger both times. The second phrase starts out identically. It's down, up, down, up again on the second string. But this time you're going to go to the third string and you're going to go to the second fret. And you're going to play that note twice going down. So the second phrase starting on the second string open, down, up, down, up. Switch to the third string, second fret, down, down. So that's our first and second phrases, and again it sounds like this from the beginning. Now the nice thing is, now we go into the third phrase. The third phrase is identical to the first phrase. So you're going to go back to the beginning of the song again, and you're doing second string open, down, up, down, up, again with your first finger, down, down. And then the only part of the song that's a little bit different is the last phrase of the song. You play twice open on the B string, down, up, then go to the third string, and again you're at the second fret, down, up, and then you're going to play the third string open twice. Down, down. So the last phrase sounds like this. Okay, so from the beginning, the song sounds like this. talked about this in class and the tip was if you're having trouble getting your middle finger down fast enough on the third string you can actually start the song with your finger there so I'm going to start with my middle finger on the third string second fret and um, and since I'm not playing that string right now it doesn't matter and it's going to make it easier so that when I do go to that string my fingers already there so if I play the song like that 
it's going to look like this and it will sound the same and then you take it off for the very last note and here's what it'll sound like when you play it with another guitar player one, two, three, four.